I'm real fortunate to be principal uh, at the elementary school where we have uh, implemented the Orton-Gillingham approach this year. It's real exciting. It's an exciting part of our school day. Um, one of the reasons I, I like it so much, it uh, gives us common terminology to work from. Uh, parent, <coughs> parents, students, uh, teachers, we all know what red words are and we know what syllabication is and pounding and finger tapping. Uh, another reason I like it is it, it gives us a lot of consistency year to year. Uh, kids build from year to year. It starts in preschool and you, you know, we keep going in kindergarten all the way up through. So uh, it's really beneficial to kids. Another reason I like it is it gives us a lot of uh, flexibility to challenge kids at different levels. Um, the parent piece is also a real positive piece of this. Uh, parents uh, see the benefits of this. Um, they understand why we're doing it and they are able to, to help their children at home. Uh, it, the last reason, I, you know, probably the, the biggest reason is uh, the most important reason, kids enjoy it. They look forward to the structure, uh, they look forward to the activities regardless of, of their abilities and um, you know, although this is our first full year of implementation, you know, next year we're, we're starting at a, at a different level and uh, we really don't know how far this is going to go. We can take it to the next level. So it's real exciting. Show. Hi, my name is Jean Luzo, and I represent the Institute for Multisensory Education. You have been sent this video because you have shown some interest in what the Institute has to offer. Did you see a little arrow that shows us which way to go? Orton-Gillingham is a systematic, cumulative, sequential approach to teaching phonics. Eighty-five percent of the English language is built upon these phonetic rules and patterns. Orton-Gillingham method includes a model for practice and review of content previously learned. The Institute instructs teachers how to conduct a three-part drill, which integrates all learning pathways, visual, auditory, kinesthetic, which enables students to master phonetic concepts. Teachers learn multi-sensory techniques using a variety of materials, including sand, screens, and visual cues. Orton-Gillingham stresses the importance of instruction at the level of individual students. The Institute for Multisensory Education provides an assessment for teachers to determine a student's entry point and instructional needs. The purpose of the assessment is to document students' prior knowledge of phonemic awareness and the foundation of language. Once students are evaluated, Teachers will know where to begin in the sequence to develop reading and writing through direct instruction. Through the Institute for Multisensory Orton-Gillingham based training, teachers will acquire the necessary tools to address objectives of the assessments. They are structured to allow teachers to document students' current progress and to provide an accurate means of tracking their progress from year to year. Divide into syllables. Josh? Right, so we're going to find our vowels. Our first the Institute for Multicenter Education has developed a comprehensive and integrated approach to teach reading, writing, spelling, and comprehension that provides classroom teachers with the skills needed to incorporate a code emphasis, multi-sensory approach into their current curriculum. It's called a suffix. All students, especially those who may not qualify for special services or who have not been identified, will benefit from success-oriented instruction. The knowledge and strategies that classroom teachers, reading specialists, resource, special education teachers, and paraprofessionals obtain from this methodology is invaluable. Our goal is to provide a comprehensive and integrated method to be used as an additional teaching tool in the classroom. Orton-Gillingham, originally targeted to provide instruction for students with reading difficulties, has been used successfully in general education for over 30 years. Therefore, all teachers benefit from the Institute for Multicenter Education, Orton-Gillingham-based instruction. World. World. W-O-R-L-D. I'm a special education teacher, and I co-teach in a third grade reading language arts class. Needless to say, I have found using a multisensory approach to be a powerful teaching tool. I've noticed that my students who have processing problems are helped in retrieving information. Also, my students who have difficulty focusing and staying on task are truly helped by this approach because they are very engaged in the learning process. 
so many of the children that I work with, their auditory channels are the weakest channels. Uh, children who have speech language disorders, that's typical. So now this adds another dimension that I can tap into. So especially the visual. Language is so transient. You just hear a sound and it's gone. Now I'm showing it to them in the graphene and oh, connecting it. So it's giving them that other modality to use. And I'm going to start using more of the tactile and the kinesthetic also to help augment the weak auditory channels. It's been awesome for me. I've made connections with the classroom teachers and I feel like a typical educator here, not just somebody that's off to the side. I'm actually right in with them. The multi-sensory approach works really well. It's really neat to be able to, with the ta finger tapping, to be able to uh, hear it and feel it and see it. And I love how we can then transfer it in the dictation a page and then put the hints for them. And that's something that I can sort of fade, but at the beginning they really need all the visual hints. So I think that's worked really well. And I love the pounding for the dictation of words because these are students who sometimes omit word endings when they're writing or they omit, or they omit whole words and they forget it. And so when we pound them out, then they're more apt to really remember all those parts and put them in their writing and I've seen improvement in their accuracy that way and uh, they feel good about it. They love the dictation and I think that's sort of cool. So they're encouraged by their success and we all enjoy it. I think it's a really cool approach. In second grade I used the Orton Gillingham 3 and I've seen that it's reaching all my learners. Uh, the audio, the visual, the kinesthetic really keeps them focused and keeps them excited about it. Um, I've seen direct transfer into their reading and their writing, um, and I'm very happy with the program and the results that I've seen. We, we introduced a new vocabulary program in our school, and I suggested to him that we sit down and chart, start using syllable division and seeing if he could figure out what the words said. And so we started dividing up the words in the book and as he started dividing them and was able to recognize what the words were, he looked at me and said, you know, Mrs. Spetter, this dividing thing really works. The Institute for Multi-Center Education is an excellent choice for your staff development needs. We provide research-based reading instruction and early intervention strategies. The Institute for Multi-Center Education create ongoing high-quality professional development with methods that support classroom, special education teachers, and reading sp specialists in presenting language instruction through a process of introduction, discovery, learning, review, practice, and evaluation. It is effective reading instruction that is built upon the following foundation. Students must understand the alphabetic principle, read sight words, and be proficient in reading words by matching speech sounds to parts of words. Mastering these essential reading concepts through direct instruction enables students to achieve fluency and comprehension. The Institute for Multicenter Education programs provide the essential components of effective reading instruction as stipulated by the NICHD and supported by the 2001 No Child Left Behind Act. Phonemic awareness, phonics, vocabulary development, fluency, and comprehension strategies. The Institute for Multicenter Education trains teachers in the explicit instruction of precisely these critical reading skills. Based on reliable research and best practices, the Institute for Multicenter Education programs are designed to give educators the knowledge and skills they need to help every student succeed. The Institute has been training for over 10 years all over the United States. We are invited back to districts for ongoing training and consultations. In addition, the University of Michigan Dearborn Special Education Department has approved and endorsed our 30-hour training as a course for graduate and undergraduate degrees. We offer a variety of training options, including the following.
We will be doing it together. You can try the first The Institute for Multisensory Education is committed to high quality staff development trainings to provide academic excellence for all learners. Tell us what Thank you're going to you do. Thank you for your time.